on the inside Stop the insanity And right now Forty-six percent of all the trash in the ocean All the plastic is wrong fishing nets Yes, wrong fishing nets Of course Don't buy plastic straws Have some bits But not eating the fish from the ocean Is something far better To help the environment down of the plastic are drift nets and also of course our fishing gear around 8% is tiny plastic break down into small sizes with a size of plankton driving in the ocean inside our coats ghost nets ghost nets kill thousands of animals in a year like dolphins, like turtles, like sea birds How can we stop that? Don't stop buying fish Hold out equal terror Whisper things out the ocean Hold that equal terror is Out of the oceans You don't need it Being healthy, fish is warm and done for with PCBs and heavy metals. Just one of the most polluted things you can eat. Since the 1950s, around 80% of the fish is being depleted In an alarming rate We will run out of fish If we don't start the Insanity on the fishing slave trade We're so like to go in Agriculture Agriculture these farms or this commercial of this Just like CSEs, so stop, stop the insanity. Tis not your rights, based on your traditions, your beliefs, and your habits to enslave animals, turn them into commodities. That's 
not what rights are about dance in justice This is shame that fishing is still allowed you think about all the environmental damage those industries are creating. Check also out my video about the fishing industry since 1950. In that video I explain in more detail than in this video why the fishing industry should be annihilated and not tolerated anymore because it is like literally the worst industry on the planet and fish are not automatons fish are self-aware creatures you can check out what a fish knows you can also check out the Cambridge Declaration of Consciousness. Animals, and even fish, have the anatomical, physiological, and neurological tools to be sentient. Something anybody, I guess, with a mind cell can understand. Because if animals need, were not aware of their surroundings, then they will not survive in the water. They don't survive in the forest. It surprised me always that, uh, that people say animals are so stupid when they are the one who are... will drive into the water if their navigation system saves. Or drive uh, or walk if they're playing Pokemon Go uh, from a building or from one cliff because uh, there are the legendary Pokemon somewhere. <laughs> Animals who are not belonging to our species are most of the time a long ago away when a um, tsunami struck. But in 2004, more than 2,000 uh, two people died when animal corpses were nearly impossible to find. Because animals were far before the disaster strike, if they get, are not locked up, and or on, top, on higher places um, where they don't can be struck by the water. When it comes to technology, we are brilliant. When it comes to, to awareness, we are on par with now something like one <laughs> dinky toy, like a um, statue. I want this. This one. <laughs> when it comes to social interaction with other species, we are like viruses. We steal their habitats. So why the fuck can we claim we are so more special or more superior to all living beings? Just because we alter the door open for somebody once in a while or because we say sorry or thank you some, sometimes to people when they give us stuff or we have, we have done something wrong words are empty mate animals can be as social aware or even more than us by far we, our species can easily recognize a blob of protoplasm uh, in one 
metallic suits with a pl protoplastic machinery weapon and recognize that as, um, as an intelligent life. But um, our species have a very hard time recognizing intelligence in a species that have evolved from a totally different way as us. We are, are can easily is say in a protoplastic bubble uh, with no brain cells out of a protoplastic weapon um, and a metallic suit. Can we recognize that that is an intelligent life? But uh, we have so much intelligent life on this whole planet, and the scientists are searching for intelligent life on some other place. If all that money was used to make technology where we can communicate with wheels with or with chimps or to understand gorillas then we can absolutely for 100% sure communicate with other intelligent life on the earth like gorillas and chimps and whales and dolphins and elephants but is that Billions of dollars are wasted any year on collect intercollectoral uh, inter um, searching for life on other planets. When we are destroying our own planet and destroying the, our planet's biodiversity, we are a sarcasm. This is the best word. I can describe our species with a sarcasm. Like Mark Twain called our species a sarcasm in his book The Damned Human Race. Check that out by the way.